<clears throat> Good morning, new day, new place. Yes, I wanted to go around, uh, I know, uh, Palampur uh, and visit the tea garden. I mean, that was the idea basically. And uh, unfortunately, you see the weather. Okay, it's, it's pouring and for the next three days, it's going to pour, I believe. So there's no question of uh, stepping out uh, to see anything. There's no way. Even if you uh, have a great umbrella with you, still, even if you get out, I mean, you still won't be able to capture any video. So um, I couldn't stay in the room anymore. And because I was there, I was in Dharamshala for about a week's time that you would know about it. So um, I said, let me go out. And it's only 9, 9 o'clock, 9, 10 in the morning. It's not 9, 9.46. So I said, let's go for a drive. In this weather, at least let us let us uh, enjoy. You know how it's going to be. <laughs> okay, so I'll see you on the route. Hopefully, um, yeah, it's it's going to lighten up, and then we can get to see some things. Otherwise, uh, I think the day is going to go just like this. Huh? What do you say? <laughs> Stay tuned. Go nowhere. You will have updates. <laughs> it's not letting up. It's not letting up. That's okay. Ah, <sighs> okay. So I'm I'm sure you would have heard this that people you know who even if somebody studying or somebody actually uh, working okay they will be praying that god give me a break give me a break so that you know i can go for a holiday but have you heard this dialogue <coughs> sorry have you heard this dialogue where anybody says god give me a break from holiday yes it was very true that you would not have heard it and it is coming from me because i was hoping and praying that give me a break from holiday I just wanted to, you know, stay in the room, do nothing, just eat, drink, whatever the case might be, and uh, you know, don't go on the net. Just, just want to sleep, get some body, uh, a body break and mental break, physical break is what I was thinking about. I think that has come today because for the next three days, the weather forecast is it's going to rain like crazy. So looks like that's going to happen. So that gives us an opportunity. I mean, I should have come live. Um, so it would have made sense where you could ask me questions. Now that I'm not live and not that famous yet. So that possibility is not there, but I'm making some pointers where you, you could, um, you will be able to understand like, you know, I'm thinking, you know, if it uh, does happen, you'll come, you'll see in the next footage, which is going to come in. I was thinking about how to help people, you know, how to, how to start a trip and uh, how every weekend they can go for a trip. What is it they can do about it? That's what I'm thinking about. And, um, and then even if that, I mean, if I can get those words and the ideas right, you will see in the next, next footage. Otherwise, I'm going to show you something even uh, on the way because it's only about 40 kilometers drive from Dharamshala. Okay, and um, in this weather, I'm not too sure if you could capture any any of the great footages. I'm not too sure about it. So, but let's just wait and what go 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 nowhere is not lighting up. So, but uh, I won't give up. So, I will give you a few tips on how exactly you can make a uh, a travel on every weekend that you can go. Every weekend, if not every day. Okay. Now, every day is, is great, but uh, what I realize is because I've been doing it for the last seven months uh, uh, at the time of recording, I've been burnt out. So, uh, daily travel uh, is not easy, actually. To, to be frank, it's not easy. Now, coming to weekend trips, how you can do that? You don't need... I mean, if you if you think about traveling by, uh, by your own vehicle, it's more tiresome, I would say that don't do it. Okay, wherever you are, whichever city that you're in, whichever state that you're in, you can actually start your weekend trips. All you need to do is, you need to either get a bus or a, a, a train. Where you, the, the distance you're going to travel, you will cover it while sleeping. You get up in the morning, fresh. Friday night you leave. Okay, Friday night, you could you decide what time you would like to leave. Suppose you leave at 6 o'clock in the evening, till 6 o'clock in the morning, you have 12 hours. That means you can carry, you can cover a lot of distance. A quite amount of distance that you can uh, cover okay because i mean you're going to get a fresh you get a fresh cover that area around you know wherever you are uh, you know ending up okay two days explore it explore it don't rush through things that i want to see hundreds of places in that given time you don't need to do that okay just explore make sure that you digest everything and you don't have to go back to the place again unless you're going in a different climatic situation where you will have a different uh, experience on the view and uh, the weather if, I mean, unless otherwise there's no point for you to go back to that because the world is so big that even if you, if you start exploring uh, you know one place a week i'm telling you our life is not enough to cover the whole whole world 
okay so that's what it is so uh, look no further don't even think about going back so friday night you leave get up in the morning on uh, saturday morning then uh, go around and sunday night sunday night you know take the bus or the train come back home fresh get up go to work go study that's all you need to do is that simple suppose you're starting late i mean say about 10 11 o'clock in the in, in the night on a friday you get about seven hours of uh, travel decide how far that, that that would take you okay get down there explore the places that's how simple it is that's how simple it is and then over a period of time i, I will teach you how you can take a you know, plane and still have a weekend the weekend trip and then do come back okay now if you'd like to know, you know, the places that you can visit around your uh, state and all this stuff, why don't you look at my channel? I've got plenty. I've got plenty in my channel. I've got plenty in uh, in Canada that I've actually done. I'll also put a link into that because uh, I started this channel, English channel, a bit late, about uh, six months uh, later after I started my Canada channel as such. So there are there are close to about ten more states that I've covered in 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 Canada language. So you can actually. Um, look into that and you'll be able to get an idea on where you can go okay and you can cover uh, you know territory by territory territory by territory that's what you certainly you can do that right so we will we will continue our journey when I, mean, I don't have much to travel but i hope uh, i may be able to get some uh, content that i uh, that i can think of where it will help you to travel so stay tuned just wanted to tell you <laughs> okay this is something that you need to hear okay <laughs> very very important <laughs> see for the last seven months i haven't done any kind of physical activity on and off also i have not done it even them physically training people uh you know helping them to get fit and um, lose weight that's my profession basically if you don't know about it and uh i mean two years five months before that also i haven't done anything much okay so i have actually gained weight i know i'm you know, uh, I put on weight on in unwanted places and all this. So that I mean, I know that part of it. But recently, it so happened that one uh, gentleman is actually an uncle. Okay, uncle called me uncle. How does that sound? How does it sound? I uh, know what I was like wanted to. Uh, you know, wanted to wanted to do that to him. But then I had the patience. So <laughs> this is what happens, people, when we are not fit, right? the the shape of a body the, even the face everything <laughs> uh, will we'll look will move to all corners of the world <laughs> so i intend to start my workout uh, you know uh, from today because i've got this great break i think this is what i was hey this is there is a nature park there is something and all here okay so that's what i intended to do i wanted to just tell you that <laughs> an uncle called me uncle mm -hmm. Are at a place um Kangada, I mean Fort we went right, 25 kilometers from here, Jwalamukhi 57, Shimla is 293, uh, Palampur where we are going is 19 kilometers, Baijnath where we can do parasailing and all the 42, Manali is 227 kilometers, the view is excellent but unfortunately the fog and the rain is covering, so see this is what it is, it's okay, see there would be a river down this bridge, so yes there is, yes there is but I cannot get off to even record it. I cannot even get off to record it. That was hard. <laughs> you want to see how it is? Look, it's so beautiful. <laughs> uh, but can't step out, can't step out. Uh, I'm feeling so sad. You see the mountain there? It would be beautiful when this, you know, it, it if it wasn't raining. Sorry that you can't see it. Even I, I am not able to see it. So don't don't feel bad. <laughs> Even though I'm physically present here, you know I can't see it. But the beautiful, you know, winding roads. I love these drives. Beautiful man. Seriously, it is beautiful. What to do? It's okay. Happens. Touch wood. Touch wood. For the last seven months, we didn't experience this. We didn't experience this. We were lucky. I'm telling you. The drive is really beautiful, but I'm actually having the difficulty in driving. You know why? Whenever there is uh, there's a hairpin bend on the left or right, I'm struggling because look at this. My windows are all fogged up. I can't see anything. That's how difficult it's been for me to drive. Look, look, look. I can't even see that there was a car there. Somewhere here only, I need to park up and then take a room. 
otherwise i'm going to miss this beauty you know i mean i won't be able to ca capture it so shall i uh, the next next uh, hotel that i will get it i'm just going to take a i'm just going to take uh, take it and i'm going to stay there just going to take a break oh this is beautiful man these are all tea estates this is tea estate wow yeah because on the left also there would be i can't see it i can't see it's beautiful i i got the room i'm just going to ask i'm going to ask i'm going to see didn't deserve what he was asking okay so but i have to definitely uh definitely i'm going to find a place here because this is beautiful this is fully beautiful miss this beauty you know because of the rain i know even if it cost me two more days to stay somewhere here i will stay here or if i have to go back to dharamshala i will go back and stay there but i don't want to miss this i want to capture this beauty this is beautiful come in and tell me that you must don't go anywhere ra please ra i want this food i want to see how it is don't go i told you didn't i i'm going to find a room i did find a room it's pouring still see it is not going to let out okay so i found a resort and uh, it's a really nice place it's Uh, amidst uh, you know uh, acres of uh, plantation and all like i just got it for about 1000 bucks and uh, really nice and it's a resort oh you want you want to see the room you should tell me now if you don't tell me how will i understand come follow me <laughs> oh this is first thing that you will want to see <laughs> i know this is what you will see you them got solar and all that this touch of that would be my bed and all that okay and uh, so i'm going to just sit out in this chair in the sit out i'm going to sit in this chair order some <laughs> things to munchies and uh, uh we're going to go about okay so i'll see you in a new day new place uh, hopefully it doesn't rain again tomorrow and if, if it rains i'll see i'll catch you in bajji pakda <laughs> uh, party okay till then stay safe till this day alive bye from me now